the perfect 10. Awarded to 14-year-old Romanian athlete Nadia Comăneci in 1976. She became the first gymnast in Olympic history to be awarded 10.0. The scoring display couldn't cope, which is why it says 1.00 in this picture. Judges went on to score Nadia six more perfect tens. That's because she didn't make errors like missteps, bent knees and falling, all of which deduct points. Nowadays, AI complements the judging process and computer vision can recognise when a gymnast's moves are worthy of a podium place. Right now, the rules have changed uh, since the perfect 10. Use the score right now, it's a combination between the execution and the bonus points, which you can get a 14, 14, 7, 15. So the only 10 is in execution. Nobody has scored yet 10 in execution because it's really, really hard. All this data is then gathered, processed, and we can provide dedicated graphics to fans watching these incredible races on TV, the capturing time, the processing time, and then the visualization of this data on screen is taking less than a tenth of a second. So it has to be extremely fast in order to be able to appreciate the athlete's performance. This year, swimming, diving, Tennis and athletics are some of the sports using AI systems to help with judging. Technology's Omega Deploy as official timekeeper will capture moments of an athlete's performance that you would not be able to see with your bare naked eye. How has it been introducing this sort of technology to the Olympic community? It's a journey um, and it's uh, first and foremost teamwork. So we obviously want to make sure that whatever we introduced has been thoroughly tested. So we'd bring it to local championships, not televised, to a national championship, eventually televised, to a continental championship, a World Cup, World Championship, and then to the Olympics. Visitors to the Games will be able to try out this AI-powered lab. It calculates sporting ability through a series of athletic drills. Time to put it to the test. It's great for talent ID, it's great to develop talent, but it is also fun. And I think people forget that with AI a little bit sometimes. We can have fun with it and, we, and actually just knowing, hey, you're suited to this sport or 70% match to this sport. We might find out something about you with a sport that you never knew. You've never played it before. Um, and I'll talk you through just, just a few things as we go around. Okay. Um, and actually, we'll get, we'll, um, we'll get someone over. Do you want to do a couple of tests as well? Absolutely. Excellent. Good. Probably most people would have some trepidation, but I'm excited. And that could be really misguided. I'm really Two, excited. One and go! While I'm pushing myself to my physical limits, my movement and agility are analysed. The stats are almost instantaneous, giving human coaches detailed reports on where their budding Olympians need help. Three, two, one. Good. Well done. Now you're feeling warm, right? Uh, that was actually really good fun. Eight out of ten. Wow, that's cool. <laughs> so we're finished with, uh, we'll get you sat down now. We're finished with some cognitive, yes? Yes, that's a great good. idea. All right. <laughs> wow. OK, I have some skills. There are cognitive drills too. These were my favourite. Two fingers ready only, and then tap the mic. Okay. So that's it. Tap, tap, tap. Go, go, go. Oh, like this. Okay. That's it. I am a concert pianist, so I'm probably treating it. Cheating a bit. Well, there you go. That's good data. Wow. Exploded. Okay. That's actually really strenuous. I know it looks <laughs> like I'm just jabbing at a screen, but it's, uh, I, I go into full focus mode, like more than when I'm pay playing Tetris. All your data is now coming in real time onto your report. Mm -hmm. And you think 8, 9, 10 is elite performer. And you think maybe that's a bit more of a 2, maybe not so much, right? So cognitive, really, really high in two of the three, a bit lower in one of them. Um, reaction's really good. Agility was about average and then a bit lower on, on the jump height. Brilliant. Can't jump, can react. That's a good summary. <laughs> oh, good, good. I really wanted to try the tasks again and improve my score, and it's certainly a great way to incentivize training because there's immediate progress reports. Apparently, I should try table tennis. <laughs> 